Hi folks, Derek Clark from the Rangers Review here. Now we all know Ibrox is a special place, especially on European nights. Just ask Joan Luigi Buffon, Victor Valdez, Thierry Henry or Alessandro Del Piero. And it now appears that the Servette goalkeeper has joined a growing list of players who have been blown away by the noise created inside the famous ground. He says the atmosphere was insane last night in the first leg of Rangers Champions League third qualifying round clash. Of course, Rangers emerged victorious, winning by two goals to one, thanks to an early James Tavernier penalty. Serial Dessers got off the mark with a goal from close range before Chris Bedia scored a penalty of his own just before a half time. Joel Mull um, said afterwards that the, we should have started the match better without giving away a penalty. It was very difficult to play it first because of the insane atmosphere in the stadium. It was amazing, but I think we recovered well. I believe we have to be satisfied with that result because we only had 10 men for a long spell in the match. Meanwhile, Servette stopper Steve Rullier has declared himself fit for the return leg despite being carried off at the end of the match at Ibrox following a head clash with Abdallah Sima that left him requiring five stitches. He said, I will be available for next week. In the end, a 2-1 defeat here in the circumstances was a positive result. After we scored the penalty, I thought we defended very well and were very disciplined. It was backs to the wall, but we were solid, although we had to thank our goalkeeper for making a few saves. He kept us alive for the second leg. And we all can't wait for it. However, we still have to realise this is an extremely high level we are playing and it will be difficult to qualify. That second leg, of course, taking place in Geneva on Tuesday night. Rangers holding that slim to one advantage. Remember, if you want to subscribe to the Rangers Review website, now is the time to do so. Just £18 for a 12-month period. Head over to rangersreview.co.uk forward slash subscribe for all the details. Bye for now.